How's it going guys, Max here. So, a lot is happening in the world of foldables right now and we have some Samsung news, so let's dive in. Firstly, Huawei just released its Mate X2 with an inward foldable design similar to the one on the Galaxy Z Fold 2. Just a year after Huawei CEO said that he will not use the Z Fold 2's design because he doesn't like it. But here we are again with the same design, so wow. And that's not the only lie he told. He said that the Huawei Mate X2 will have no hinge in the display but as he was unveiling the phone, a ray of light just glanced through the phone exposing the so-called in quotes, hingeless display. And that's not all. Uh, new leaked images showed that the phone has a major hinge unlike what Huawei said. And uh, though I have other things that I don't like about the phone, like how it's priced at around $2,800, I will just wait for some reviews before I give my full thoughts on this foldable. Speaking of foldables, we have some news on the upcoming Galaxy Z Fold 3. Firstly, Ice Universe says that Samsung X AMD GPU is scheduled to be showcased in June, around the time that the Galaxy Z Fold 3 is rumored to be released meaning that we are just about 3 months away from seeing one of the best chipset collaborations in history. Also, a few minutes ago, Samsung released a video showing their new ISOCELL sensor that is ready. And man, this looks great. It now focuses with two lenses just like the normal human eye and it will definitely get more image quality in it. And honestly, I personally feel that they didn't use this on the Galaxy S21 Ultra just to reduce the size of the sensor. And not just that, usually Samsung doesn't test their own camera technology first, so we should be seeing it on the upcoming Xiaomi Mi 11 Ultra. As but not the least, we have some renders of the Galaxy A82 via Let's Go Digital and I'll just say that we should take this with a pinch of salt, but it actually further confirms that we will see the under display camera with the Z Fold 3, not in the A series. But of course, that's my suggestion. Let me really think about everything I've said in the comment section. Subscribe and I'll see you next time.